Hello and welcome back everyone. So today we are going to be playing the demo version of Outriders and uh, they say that this game is a true version of hybrid RPG and uh, in this game we are going to be having a gameplay uh, filled with guns and uh, some violent powers we are going to be having and uh, it seems to be like the powers are going to be some really good and uh, we can apply it in the game and uh, we can have a really good gameplay with that so let's not waste time and let's hop into the game and let's start so let's continue and uh, yeah and uh, well the graphics seems to be really good. The anomaly should have killed us. But instead, it left us something more. Oh. Altered and outrider. So it gave us some powers. Only yes. we can lead them to a future. So uh, we all have some powers in some way or the other and the guns are really amazing. Uh, it seems to be, it has been set in some we futuristic before, version of the world. We're something new now. We well. were given a second life. We can't waste it. So a lot of, the, uh, a lot of players and a lot of uh, being seems to be aliens in this game uh, cannot say if, it is, if they are really is or they just belongs to our own planet or some outsider world but i think they, they are going to be belonging to the outsider world uh, okay so we have to be making a account before uh, moving further ahead so let me make an account first so uh, i think now we can proceed to our game and uh, okay so we have to be choosing among our characters now uh, we can even customize the character but for now i will be continuing with this only i think it's fine okay we have to customize but i really like the uh, I already like the character so let's create this for character okay so I'll write my own screen name nice so as I told you that this is the demo version and uh, and the whole game is going to be released pretty soon so you can also try this demo version either on your playstation uh, either on your xbox and for pc it is only available at steam right now so you can be doing all these stuff and uh, we can play with our friends as well so it is going to be online as well and uh, so i think i sh uh, i'm not uh, Obviously it is going to be a new game, so let's start with a new game only. Yeah. So we have to be uh, joining a new lobby. And... Uh, okay. The first mission is to locate the probes dropped from the floors that were supposed to be sending telemetry data about the planet. Recover the probes and extract the information stored in their drives. So first of all, we have to recover the probes and do. Then uh, it is our only first mission. We have to then recover the information. Earth was dead. We had destroyed it. Two colony, two colony ships were built to carry us across the stars. Only one ship made it. We are all that's left. Okay. After an 83-year journey, we orbit our new home. 
so only one ship made up to the new planet and uh, we are the ones in it the planet Anorch so it's a planet Anorch humanity's last damn chance so maybe there are going to be some alien life into this planet to which we have to fight and earn our own space into this planet I think it is going to be like this I, I mean we can figure that out right from the trailer only that they were fighting the aliens on that whereas we are going to be seeing that what it is going to be happening if it is not aliens or something else I cannot say the ship is pretty big. It seems to be really big. Flawless command. You are clear to begin descent to surface. Copy. Just engaging. Initiating auxiliary thrusters. Okay, so these are the ports and Man, maybe... We are to atmosphere breach. Yeah, the ports are atmosphere. going to be carrying humans, I believe. And the graphics really look amazing and they resemble the graphics from Far Cry and the, the Last of Us I should say. Uh, I hope the gameplay is also going to be the same uh, good but all that matters is the gameplay, the, uh, how your character is going to uh, make you feel like, I mean how real it is going to be feel like in your game when you're going to move around and the pots are really big they are really huge so this this place seems to be like earth only all the trees all the environment and atmosphere and the pots are really huge they are really huge and I didn't expect that I mean, they are really huge. Let uh, look at the trucks and all the now people inside the truck. Six, multiple defense lines and an operating base established within the hour. Move! Goodman, a word. You know the stakes of this mission. Flores is already half dismantled. Our engine's on its way down to power a city of half a million. Now, if these outrider bozos had paid us, you report to me first. So there are half a million Sir, of people in into this. this We're not on Earth, ship. There is no proper procedure. Listen up, Outriders. I know what you're all thinking. There's no going home. And no one has a clue what's waiting for us out there. But the ECA pencil heads can't green light this land until we find their missing probes. So let's do our job! Yeah, we have to find the probes. It is our first mission. And uh, it is quite uh, new that a storyline is being built upon an online game surface man. I mean, if you are going to have some online player in this, then it will be really amazing. Oh. Some alien-like animals. I mean, obviously. Everything is alien to us, every life is alien to us. It doesn't matter if it's a micro, uh, microbe or a complex organism. I'm going to scout ahead on foot. need to stretch my damn leg. I'll take point. Don't need to see it on day one. Relax, I'll ride. So, I th uh, yeah, this is our character. And let's... I wouldn't be here without you. I'd be buried in the ashes back home. Oh. Let's move out. So I can Stay move. Sharp. Yeah. Okay. I can play tab to follow a chow. We have to follow Captain Tanner. Would you smell that air? I can't even process breathing air that doesn't smell like a burnt carburetor. <laughs> Fresh air too. Truth is, none of us should have even thought about that. Survivor's guilt. You think any one of us isn't feeling it? It's not just that. If the Caribou's engine hadn't exploded back on Earth and killed most 
of the real operators will feel like there would be a bunch of mercenaries down here in their place. I hired you because you don't let anything get in your way. So maybe we are mercenaries with, the, uh, with all those people uh, into this location. But I'm still doubtful that why are we online in this game. Uh, because I cannot see that there are any online players in the game. Okay, the data reader will help you to locate quest objects, enemies, and more points of interest. So we have a radar on. <clears throat> we'll make camp here. Outrider, set a beacon flag. Let HQ know the area is secure. The area really seems to be secure. Really. I don't think so that we have to do anything else. Oh, okay, some animal. So we have to plant a flag or some signal to make sure that the area is secure towards the headquarter. <coughs> uh, the trucks look really cool. They seem to be rovers more than truck. So we have to set the parameters, I think. Yeah, they told us that the journey was 85 years, of 85 years. And uh, this seems to be a game based upon survival. We won't be looking good That's as we grow good. fat in this. On my way around bullets, not kids. Be no need for somebody to be here. Maybe the old you, Outrider. But you're one of the chosen. So we are some kind of rangers, and we have to set up everything for the civilians, I believe. I'm gonna head out and find Jakub. Did your family made it off Earth? Let's ask him about the family. So they are just reciting their story and their background so that we can be aware of everything happening to, uh, to us and, and to other people. The graphics are good. The graphics, I will say, they are pretty futuristic and they are balanced, I would say. They are not too over animated and something like that. But not that too real as well. Good mood since they unfroze your ass. <coughs> Still pushing him. <laughs> yes, sir, mm. granddad, sir. So let's find Jakub then. Did any more of your people make it off? Ah, uh, uh, I just mistakenly did that. 
let me skip. Two for one special. Don't push it. So let's go and find Jakob. I'll go find Jakob's shooting range. Good. We're on standby for those probes, so stay on alert. And uh, okay. Journal entry. You have access to new journal entry. J. Uh, we have to press J. Okay. And uh, this guy is Charles Maxwell. In the journal, you can find further information about characters, enemies, local locations, collectible journals, and more. So we have Jack Tanner as our Outrider Captain and Charles Maxwell as ECA Sergeant Major. Okay. So we just know two of them. <clears throat> we have grouped the Outriders. Article looks like who are the Outriders. So Outriders were formed by the leaders of the Enoch Localization Authority, a handpicked group of the finest specialists with scientific engineering and military expertise with ex with the purpose of surviving as humanity's vanguard so as i say we are kind of the army or rangers or we can call ourselves whatever we can uh, we are we are the scientific guys military expertise with military exp expertise and all so we can provide uh, all the good stuff and we can settle out the humanity onto a new planet for the basic civilians of the, uh, from Earth and all, and all, so they say us outriders. So I'll try to remember the <coughs> term for us. And uh, one more thing, Notch Colonization Authority. Okay, leave it. So let's do our task, and our task is going to be talk to Jakob about field testing your weapons. I can see the gameplay is not that bad but it is quite animated i will say it is not that real or something like that so we have to lead up to yahoo so he's yahoo okay <clears throat> so he's calling us boss, so we are senior. I'm ready for target practice. That last day on earth was a nightmare. Watch this. So I think I should not be talking to him a lot. Let's stick to the target and let's let's test our gear. Time to test my gear. Uh, up for some target practice, boss. Let's get started. <clears throat> So we have two of our guns and uh, take cover behind the crates, okay? Uh, yeah. Fancy stuff. Yeah, a new toy. You're the first one to test it out, boss. That was a hard shot. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. Oh. You think you could take on a tank? <laughs> we just started. We are we showing off? Okay, so we have equipped our pistol now. Oh, I missed it. So the main weapon is AR. <laughs> so we must be hibernating for 85 years and it is quite a long time so we are definitely uh, have been hibernating from our 
move from the up. Okay. So now we have to talk to Shira. Shira, we just had our first aim practice. <laughs> okay, so she's a uh, captain's daughter. Yeah, it is. So that must be the aliens residing upon this uh, planet who are interfering with our own technology. Look like the signals back. Hey, is that supposed to be that way? Oh, 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 oh. That's a so finally, we are uh, getting some kind of mission where we close. have to find the probe. Copy that. Hey, it's an historic moment. <laughs> okay. We should document it. Cool laptop. I mean, sorry, it's a tablet, I believe. <laughs> so they are taking a selfie. <laughs> so I think we have our first mission unlocked and we have to locate the probe. Heavy car, we're going to, okay. So I have to be on foot only. <laughs> oh, it's a stampede. It's a stampede, I think. <laughs> they should be vegetarian. <laughs> I mean, imagine we just have landed and they have just broken all our stuff and do they are attacking us or something like that. <laughs> okay, so they just ran away. Uh, one of those cow oh. is setting itself right on my path. Hey, maybe you can get close enough to get a DNA sample. It's not exactly our priority, but if I can get close without spooking it, I'll try. Okay, so this is how I have to be climbing up. Ah, we found our first uh, probe. So we are gathering the data. It seems to be like a capsule. Carrying the astronauts. So finally we are having an interaction with aliens. I think the, uh, the interference we can hear is the interference we are getting. It is the secondary interference we, were, we are getting, we are talking about. So what do we have, what do we have to do? 
so we have to report back to the tunnel uh, to the captain let's go back then okay so now we can sprint yes we can sprint now that's great okay That's a source. big mountain. That's there. really a big one. Hope you all brought your galoshes. <laughs> Jacob, same shit. So we are going with the. Uh, 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 we are going into. Uh, I mean, we are going there in some vehicle, I think. What's happening? Oh yes, so we are going in, in, in a truck, in a rover-like truck. Uh, the truck really looks familiar, I must say. And yeah, the technology is already freezing up. We have just so landed on this planet, and now. it's pretty getting. Wolf. Soldier, your primary focus, Shira. So I think we are going to be having a first ever gunfight. So maybe we are not turned into some humans with powers uh, yet. I mean, after the interaction with these aliens, I believe we are going to be getting turned into some. Uh, Choke on your own spit, dude. Powered up humans where we can use uh, supernatural powers. What is this? Some anti gravity event? I mean, the liquid is flowing above that black liquid. Oh, another probe, I think. No. Yeah. Tanner, got eyes on the probe. I got movement. Heading in. Reloading. Arrival. Course completed. So. Okay. all over the place that 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 black thing and uh, we uh, but we could see the probe right from that location only why are we going that further oh really do we have to kill it ah i think we have to whoa so this is our very first interaction with this uh, animal kind of alien or something. Okay, so he's so he's so he's attacking us now. Okay. No, 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 no. Uh, seriously, I cannot see him properly. Wow, that was. Close, that was close, that was again close, yeah, I just got hit once again, and I, I just killed my first ever uh, alien thing. Captain, got attacked by one of those cow things. Whoa. Something drove it crazy, I had to put it down. Keep an eye out. Copy that out, Ryder. Now move your ass and find that probe. Well, 
there's a lot of uh, animation i can see uh, maybe you have just to introduce the plot of the main game okay so it seems to be like they have landed with a parachute with uh, attached to it So there's definitely going to be some alien life, some advanced alien, alien life. So again, we are having that anti-gravity event, something like that. Copy. That means that um, they are aware of our presence onto their planet. That alien life. But did uh, but we didn't copy the data. Uh, the probe has been destroyed, I think. Okay, so they are attacking us. I can see they are attacking us. The red circles. It shows that they are going to be dropping those some. The projectiles are dropping upon that red. Uh, red, red Targets. Whoa. Okay, okay, that was that was really that's really close. It's really close. It's really close. It's really close. Whoa. Oh, that was really amazing. <laughs> guy will uh, that guy just got vaporized that's crazy that's really crazy that's really crazy So we are also getting vaporized. We are, yes, we are. But they left us. So now they are attacking our vehicles. Okay, so he came to pick us. Oh, okay. But I didn't see him getting any shot or something like that. Can't say. Okay, so our main mothership is uh, still into the space. I mean, uh, the ship haven't landed yet. There's just a one single pod 
which have landed onto this location. And uh, I think we have received some of that supernatural power because they left us and uh, before that we were in we were in connection to them at some place. Oh It must have been a stupid act. I mean, okay, so they are they are putting us into a quarantine, I think. We have to fight them. Oh. Nice shot. Collect new equipment from the from the chest and inspect it in your inventory. Okay, so we have to collect some equipment from the chest. Yeah. So that's a backup rifle. Okay, that's nice. Is that it? Okay. Okay, so I have to open the inventory and uh, So we have just collected a shotgun I think Yeah, it is a shotgun uh, What is this? Turner's backup rifle So it is Captain Turner's backup rifle Yeah Okay, let's come back Oh uh, this rifle is pretty uh, good, I think. It's better. Uh, I can see some green thing over the map. What are they? Okay, so they are the allies we are having with us. Okay. Okay, so I think we have to stop the landing first. Oh, what was that? So this is really nice. The gameplay is really amazing. I must say the gameplay is really cool. And this gun is really, it's really nice. This gun is really nice. I mean, it really has a better damage and uh, fire rate. Okay, so there's that guy and we are having that red attack. Uh, I mean, I think they're throwing grenades upon us Okay, I cannot see that properly Um, I cannot even take cover now Oh 
Oh, so the sergeant is down. <clears throat> that's nice, that's nice. I mean, such a stupid guy he is. I mean, this is a different planet, it's not Earth even. And uh, he's already making his enemies, that's really stupid of him. Back into cryo until Medlock can see this fucking life. Don't be ridiculous. I'm done for. Pep talk for you, Billy, my thing. Oh, she's putting us in some uh, pot for maybe she's putting us back into hibernation or maybe for healing purpose. I cannot say. So I think it healed us and uh, yes, we are healed up, maybe. What year? Is this future or is this really? I mean, all those people uh, with whom we were uh, together are not here, I think. Really? The ship has got plants and all these things upon, upon the place? I mean, we are in the future. I think we are in the future now. Oh... That's really horrific. <clears throat> I mean, the story is taking, taking off. I mean, if we are in the future now, then it is really going to be horrific, I should say. <laughs> Seriously. I mean, we can see this whole place. I mean, it wasn't like this before and uh, all these bunkers and all. I think this is some future, some years ahead because it wasn't like this before. And even there are some vehicles. Uh, we, we didn't have these kind of vehicles with us. They were more advanced, I should say. Tanks! Whoa! I think this is really far ahead from the time we landed this area. This place, this planet. Oh, 
these people are really stupid <laughs> they are just destroying their own 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 territory i mean this seems to be a, uh, this seems to be an all new generation i think can't say He's saying something. Oh, I think the uh, I think all these peoples are the civilians. Uh, which were in the main ship or something like that oh what are they doing i mean why did she even left us into that pod uh, why didn't she uh, uh, why didn't she wake us up shira Uh, she would have been with us so this is just the introduction to another story i should say and the timeline has moved forward ah oh, we dropped out of the vehicle so i'm pretty convinced that this is some years ahead of that landing we made before and now we are having a war with those aliens i think wow that's 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 hilarious i must say so whatever they are who so ever they are they are just attacking with this super natural power or something some power like this i must say i mean they are not fighting with us physically they are instead using their these powers choose your path oh so we are being introduced with parts now technomancer long range support gadgets so they are going to be the technical guys i believe pyromancer medium range conjurer fire oh close range hit and run space time devastator close range tank stand your ground i mean i don't even know how is it going to be working but let's choose technomancer manipulate the anom anomaly to animate animate constructs and bend them to your will aiding allies and killing enemies from afar so we are going to be playing a far game this way as the technomancer you will recover a portion of the damage you deal as health okay and the pyromancer are going to be cover foes with cover foes in flames in incinerate and dash squads and heal your own wounds as enemies fall to your inferno as a Uh, you will recover health okay trickster is going to be behind the laws of space and time to appear out of nowhere assassinate your enemies and they are also showing us the whole video that what we are going to be doing uh, if we choose to spot and return to safety in blanks of an eye devastator take point and defend your allies like this okay ground and force alike the tremble your path Pass. I'll pick technomancer only. Follow the path. Okay. Are you sure you want to be a technomancer? You want to be? You cannot. Okay. Yeah. Let's pick this thing. I believe it is going to be cool. So. 
so uh, <clears throat> this some kind of a power is giving us that path and uh, choosing that path will give us with i mean it will give us that kind of power we are needing to be becoming a tactomancer that cho- uh, the path we chose and uh, yes so as they oh, as they already told us in the introduction of this game that we are going to have some powers in this uh, game uh, doesn't matter we are humans but we are going to be having those powers that's great so i think guys that's enough for today and uh, i think that's enough to introduce you with the game and uh, the demo mode is still up and i can even play further but for this video i will keep up to this uh, up to this point only and uh, i will be continuing with the outriders demo further into the next video and uh, you can also play the demo version on steam for pc and uh, on consoles it is going to be there in the store so uh, what i will say for this game is that this game is a really good game uh, as they say that uh, it is an rpg hybrid game and i really love this game i really like the graphics and the gameplay the gameplay is still kind of an ga- uh, i mean the gameplay for this game is still based upon the games which are uh, a good competitors in rpg world and i will say that it's good for an rpg game the gameplay is not that realistic i mean the movements and uh, all the things you are going to do in this game is not uh, that real but it is good for a combat rpg game i must say so uh, thanks for watching and uh, do hit the like button if you like my video and found it useful and uh, do consider subscribing my channel as i am going to be uh, uh, playing this game further ahead and do visit my channel as i play a lot of more games upon my channel so stay tuned for more thank you thanks for watching